Home link 1-3, finding the area of rectangles. The directions say find the area of the rectangles below. Write a number sentence for each problem and explain how you found area. So, we know that this is one whole centimeter and a half. So our number sentence would be one and a half centimeters and we can either add or I might multiply two because I see one whole centimeter and two whole centimeters times two centimeters and so I can say I counted the two whole so I counted the two whole so then I have one two and so it's three centimeters square total so I counted the whole squares, whole square centimeters, one, two, whole square centimeters. I put the two half square centimeters together to make another whole square centimeter. So all together there are three. We could use the word add combined because what did we do with those two halves? We added them together to get one whole. The next one, you have two and a half centimeters by three you can, don't forget, you can count the squares, you can extend the lines to draw, and use repeated addition, you can use multiplication, so just remember to explain how you got your answer. Whatever you did is what I want to see written down there. At the bottom, it says solve, and you have 36 inches equals how many feet? The answer is three. We find that in our student reference book, or we know one foot equals 12 inches. So we could do 36 divided by 12, or use repeated addition until we got the 36. So here's one foot, two foot, three feet. Four is how many inches is there in five feet? So if we know 12, we have five feet, and we know there's 12 inches in a foot times five. Five times five is, or five times two is 10. Five times one is five, plus one is 60. So then you have 60 inches equals five feet. Now you need to find out how many feet are 18 inches, and how many inches are in a half foot. 